Hey everybody, we are playing Dark and Light once again, and today we're going to be playing around, doing our thing. I don't have a super set plan for today, but I will figure something out. Okay, well this one's got to go. What are you doing? Wham. Ooh. Okay. I was going to say, it's a, it's a high level, but not, not really. It's, it's level 4, so I don't have to worry about that. But yeah, I'll be right back once I have something in... Okay, guys, I think I know what the plan is now, so it's kind of night out, and I don't like it, but I guess I'll start on it anyway. One of the biggest things that we need in this game that isn't just, like, very easy to get is fur. Now, the easiest way to get fur is obviously to go around and kill animals, but a lot of times they don't spawn, and there's not enough, and it's kind of hard to get, and there's a lot of waste of material. So, how we fix that is we make a sheep farm. Uh, so let me just take, because I was just farming with this guy here. We make a sheep farm. So we tame a bunch of sheep, we give them grass, and they turn it into fur. Which, yeah, I guess it makes sense, right? Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to get uh, all of the materials together, so the troughs, the bows, the arrows, and then we're going to start doing it. Okay, everybody, so before we actually start gathering the sheep and start... Uh, so a little bit of farming, we do have to make room for them, first of all, because I need to put them somewhere. I don't want random things to get to them. So, let's build, like, not very big, just a little, little place back here. Um, probably, let's, let's remove this tree real quick. We'll add two more over here. Oh, that is a scary sound. Yeah, there are our teams so far right up there. Surprisingly, none of my teams have died yet. My first playthrough through this game, most of my, I mean, I went through at least like 10 vultures and like at least a couple boars, so I'm surprised they're still alive. I mean, at the same time, I haven't really done anything with them, so maybe it's, it sh they should be alive because I haven't really done anything with them, but um, okay, let's do this. I was about to place that wrong by accident, Ooh, like that, like that. Like that. One more, and then the door will go here. Use the item, bam. Now, I don't think I'll need a sky on this. I might add one later, but for now, I'm not going to. For now, I'll just keep it like this. But this is where our sheep are going to go. Now, let's see. Do I have anything? Okay, I got to place these down. So these are going to be the things that kind of hold our grass and stuff. Because that's what we're going to have to give them. We're going to have to give them grass. Let's place another one right here. Oh, okay. I dropped it. So that's cool. Come on, game. I don't know what I keep pressing to drop stuff. I keep doing it by accident. Okay, there we go. So now we have our bow. We have... I made a bunch more arrows. And made some troughs. Now... The only thing that I need to get is obviously food for the sheep, and I'm pretty sure, well, I'm sh I know they're uh, herbivores. I don't know if they only eat grass or if they eat berries and stuff too, but for now, I'm just going to grab some berries from big guy over here. Are you good? Is he dying? Uh, okay, he must be just be sleeping. Okay, I just want to make sure he's not dead or anything. Alright, so hopefully, yep, okay, I was like, hopefully that one falls asleep. Okay, uh, now let's go ahead and oh, I'm hoping it reaches both of them. If it doesn't, it's fine. But, okay, if I place it right there. Let's see, and let's put some food in here. Does it? It reaches this one. It should be able to reach this one. Ah, are you serious? That's like a little bit just too far, isn't it? That's a little bit tilting. Okay, well, I could place a trough here. Let's go ahead and place some berries in there. And uh, sheep are like the lowest level in the game. So they should tame quite quickly. Oh my god. Literally, of course. I said, I hope something doesn't get in that hole while I'm gone. Of course, a wolf spawns right there. Oh my god. That is so stupid. That is so dumb. Are you... Come here stupid why would you do that man ah uh. ok 
Okay, well, uh, we're gonna need to get more sheep, I guess. Stupid, stupid. And I guess I'll close up the back. Uh, I wanted to be cheap and not waste the one wall, but ugh, that is quite annoying, actually. I'm gonna have to find more sheep. Well, I guess we're restarting. Thankfully, there's a sheep like right there. Although I need to make all new troughs and everything. But for now, let's build one trough real quick because I'm going to take care of this one while I'm working. Probably just should kind of... Since I have to rebuild... Well, I guess three sheep isn't a gigantic amount, but still. I'm hoping it falls over after two. I got to stop. Like, I need to not waste so many nowadays. I'm going to have to keep making more. Even one will probably do it, but... put this down see and of course right around the corner it's a stupid animal that wants to kill everything and he killed a sheep God. man I hate these things let's see if even the okay so this sheep is alive surprisingly and then we have a sheep that is like stuck in here let's go ahead and remove this tree come on will he just fall over already of course, he's going to run all the way over here and just plop himself inside the water. Ugh. All right, well, let's at least move this guy over here. Might as well. And then I'll just have to keep an eye on him, make sure uh, a hyena doesn't get to them. Which is a little bit hard because I can't really keep an eye on him at all times. But let's move this guy towards over here. And then, I'm not going to bother putting him in a building. Just because if he's going to die, he's going to die no matter what. So let's just tell him to stay here. And uh, chill with his buddy right there. Alright, there we go. That's a second sheep. Let's make sure this one's still doing fine. We got a boar right here. But, see, boars are cool. They're scary looking and they're strong. Well, not, not really. But, they're not attacking random things like little sheep. You know? Not like the Bargash. The disgusting creatures that they are what's up with you okay his constitution's low again i have to like keep shooting these guys but oh okay this guy's still following come why are where's your okay i was gonna say where's your buddy at don't tell me he died i forgot to tell him to not follow so let's bring him back all right there we go a third sheep so let's follow. And then let's break this. And then take all of that. Alright, come on. Right now we'll have three. If I can find any more, like, right near, I'll grab it. But at this point, we could have six. But no, because half of them got slaughtered by a stupid wolf. And literally, just the beginning of this episode, I was surprised that none of my teams have died. And then, uh, of course, what happens? My, my, one of my, three of my teams actually died. Not just one, but three. Which isn't too surprising considering they're sheep, but still. And then let me break this. Because I'm probably going to need some materials for another trough here. Yeah, but st stuff is expensive in this game, I'm telling you. It ain't easy. Gotta do so much farming just for so little. Alright, now this time y'all won't die on me. And then while they waddle over here, let's make another trough. I craft six. Okay, well then we're... Alright, there we go. Three little sheep right there. So now basically what we do... So let me take out my sword. Uh, let me try to get some grass here. I'm trying to get some grass, not uncommon grass. It's kind of annoying is... We keep getting like uncommon and rare things, but the thing is that actually messes me up because I just need the normal stuff, not the uncommon stuff. So let's just get a little bit here. It takes quite a bit of grass, so we we do have to like run around and swing our sword quite a bit. But fur is not easy to get, so pretty much the best way to do this is to have a sheep farm. So it's pretty much like a needed thing. So let me just swing a bit more. Right, let's head over there while swinging our sword. Try to get a few 
few patches here and there. Okay, so let's see. I'll show you guys. They're pretty much like an like a I don't want to call them like a utility, but if we go in here and I think if we place some grass in there, right? Click on here and craft all. And it crafts super slowly, but uh it gives us fur. That's pretty much all we need. Ooh, I see I see a skeleton in the distance. Let's see. Do we have any normal arrows on us? Okay, we have some normal arrows. Let's try to take it down. I always kept luring them to the villagers, but let's try to actually take this boy down. I keep saying how hard- okay. It's level 34. It's pretty big. We can take it down though. It'll just take quite a few arrows. Yeah, I'm telling you, these boys are strong. And I'm wasting so many arrows doing this, but you know what? Bam. He thought he was big and bad. But essentially, he ooh, what is this stuff? Okay, rare, rare boar saddle. Okay, craftable leather gloves and a new bow. You know what? Not very cool things, but you know what? I'll take it. We could even put on these gloves and a rare bow. I wonder what it does. It just like weigh less or something? I don't know, but I guess let's increase our weight again and our health. Oh God, they knocked me out. This isn't good. They're taking all my stuff. That guy, he has my stuff. That isn't good. Oh no. Okay, I need to. I'm gonna have to get my stuff back somehow. Alright, here's what I'm gonna do. You made me do this. I'm gonna go get my hyena. You. Stay right there. Don't despawn. Stay right there. Don't despawn. And I'm going to go get my uh, killing machine here. And I'm going to kill you. Alright. Come on, big guy. Let's go kill some goblins. Just please don't despawn. I mean, I didn't go that far away, but... Ugh. And goblins are so annoying. They get one hit on you, one hit on you, and they just knock you out. All right, come here. Bam! Oh god. Okay, what level are you? All right, I could probably beat you. All right, is there another goblin? All right. Now, which one of you had my stuff? Which one of you had my stuff? I think. It All right. Well, I guess we just kind of lose a bunch of our equipment here because the goblin just seemed to have disappeared. But um, I guess it's fine. Oh, well, we lost the sheep too, didn't we? Ah, oh, that's so annoying. Oh my god. Oh, they didn't steal my stuff. My my. I think he just got it all on him. Okay, well, uh... Oh, that's actually the wrong thing. I need to increase his attack. And then I guess I'm going to increase his weight. Alright, you know what, guys? For now, I'm just going to leave three sheep. I want to get more, but I just... I want to go do something else, and I've already spent so much time just getting three. It's kind of annoying. At this point, I should probably put my effort into starting to collect some grass to actually start making fur, because right now they're just not doing it. Okay, guys, we're going to, first for the first time, actually go on kind of a long adventure. So what we're going to do, we're going to take one of our birds over here, and we're going to head up into those islands right over there. You can kind of see them through the trees. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's a lot of ore up there, and I want to kind of check it out. I mean, of course, I know what's up there, but I haven't done it in this series yet. So, what we're going to do is we're going to take the higher level vulture, and we're going to head up there. This one's level 29, and it has a saddle already on it. Let me see. Let's carry its weight, because obviously, we're going to have to carry stuff on this boy. But yeah, let's just get going, and it's a slow fly, but we'll get there. But, one thing to note is when we get the wyvern, those things are super speedy. Which, at the same time, they can't carry, I don't think, as much as the vulture. They are super speedy. But for now, 
it is a little bit slow but we're gonna make our way up there but before we do i guess let's check this out because we actually haven't seen this creature yet this thing is a trent it is pretty much like a giant wood tree thing that attacks people uh, i don't i don't think it's actually like it's not aggro it's only aggro if you attack it which is kind of cool what is going on here what is that oh that's a panther okay peace out I'm not trying to fight that thing not with not with the flying creature what see I keep seeing this blue like circle I'm pretty sure it's like to kind of symbolize that this is like a renting zone you can rent those buildings but I don't know that's just weird I don't know why it's been added recently because that wasn't there before okay guys so just a little bit of information about this place since I last have been here it's pretty much just a bunch of floating islands but there's a lot of cool ore like a lot of different ore that that is a very scary sound there's nothing behind me right okay there's nothing behind me <laughs> um, there's a lot of wind elementals down here and a lot of bad creatures so we do have to be careful because reapers and skeletons there's a lot of those I'm pretty sure like a lot of them so we do have to be careful but I think there is one specific type of ore that we can only get up here which is that white stuff that you see I see there's a will and elemental just falling for some reason I guess let's drop right here there's nothing right here to kill us for now let's make sure there's nothing around us and he okay I think he'll stay let's try to see what's in here okay can we even mine this we might need to come back with a better pick because I don't want to wait I think I forgot materials with me yeah so I can't really like fix anything so let's just not waste our energy on that yeah let's try to look for some interesting creatures up here there's another wind elemental and for some reason they they're kind of dumb I think this one's just chilling flying through the air I don't is that all is that supposed to I don't know if that's supposed to happen but I'll take it there's also some weird altar stuff like there's a building okay those are the things that we need to mine those things have ore in them but let's quickly check out this little temple there's a lot of weird stuff up here and actually we'll probably be able to fix our pick if it breaks because there's a there's a good amount of material around here but yeah there's this weird temple thing and actually I don't really know what to do with it I know if we go up here okay and if we place certain stuff here okay hopefully he lands okay if we place can we can like okay we can't really do anything with that you could place certain things here to make certain things which I know I'm being very broad because I really don't know my last playthrough I did not get this far to do anything with here so I'm pretty much as clueless as anybody else on that front for now though let's stop to grab some materials okay guys we're pretty much gonna have to head back soon I forgot that my brain power is running a little low I did forget to sleep a little bit which isn't good and it's falling pretty fast but I mean this is pretty much the island um, there's not too many exciting things but real quickly let's stop here because we can mine these so let's go ahead and mine these while we're here and these things do produce iron ore I think mostly I don't know if they have copper but they these ones do produce iron which we can't really do anything with yet but we are very very close to actually doing things with them anyway so I'll, might as well grab some while we're up here all right guys we pretty much cleared all of it we got like over 200 iron our focus is a bit low there's only like one more rock over there so I'm just gonna leave it for now and we're pretty much gonna head back home but I do want to check out up here because I did, did see some fighting kind of wanted to see what was up and show you kind of a closer look at these air elementals now they didn't do this when I first came here okay um, whoa, I thought I almost jumped off for a minute here we could see music is so loud like meteorites and there's different like other mobs 
So if we go over here, you can see these are magma elementals, fire elementals, dark fire elementals. So those things will kill us. That is for sure. Is there anything near here? Can we stop right here? Is this safe? I think the dark elementals are trying to get to us, right? Yeah, the dark elementals are trying to get to us. Let's see if we can get this. Nope, we need to be level 35. or only 25. Okay. Well, we definitely need to st steer clear. But it's kind of funny. The dark fire elementals are actually fighting the skeletons. Now, do these things... Oh, they do want to attack me. Okay, let's get out of here before we die. Well, that was pretty close. Okay, well, it seems like they, they fight other things, too, that are bad. And then these things don't attack, right? I'm pretty sure the, those things don't attack. But, yeah. So, this is kind of like the islands up here. But we should probably start heading down. Make sure we don't die because of something like focus, which is really, really dumb. But also from here, you can kind of get a good look at the map. So most of it looks snowy just because of the fact that, like, it's winter. But usually, only right over there it's snowy. Usually, only over there. And then, of course, it's like volcano over there. And then this is usually just like grasslands. But, well, apparently not anymore. All right, we have made it back home safely. But actually not for long because we're going to go back out. I'm just going to drop some of this stuff and then we're gonna go back out but this time we're gonna go that way instead of towards the islands i want to make sure there's nothing dangerous around here I'm just gonna just hop inside here for a moment pretty much i'm just gonna stick the oh 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 that hurts <laughs> uh it's light okay, come on game <laughs> light that back up and then we're just gonna stick the iron in here we can't really do anything with it yet but uh, once we can, we will be making it, of course, into iron bars. I'll just stick this random stuff in here. Actually, we need that and that pretty much. So I'm going to keep the rest of that stuff. And most importantly, before we leave, let's make sure we fill up our brain power. Because I don't want to leave without having our brain power replenished. Bam. Brain power is back. Now, we're holding something that's apparently heavy. I wonder what that is. Well, it must be just this stuff, which will keep on us for now. And, yeah, I could probably bring a bed with me, but you know what? I think we'll be fine. So, this could be a dangerous mission. This is probably not a very good idea, but you know what? We need some adventure in our lives. So, we're going to go out and... I'm just gonna probably head that way, and I'll tell you if something cool happens. Oh, okay, what do we got here? We got some griffins attacking some stone elementals. And there goes a griffin. Oh, what was that sound? Oh, it's a wavering, okay. I was like, what is that? And I'm kind of tempted to grab that griffin's stuff. Maybe we're able to. Let's go grab this griffin stuff. Okay, that one doesn't have anything. Oh, those are just brundas. They're not even griffins. Alright, well, let's get out of here then. Is he trying to fight a wavern? Okay, no. For a second, I thought he was fighting a wavern. I'm like, why? Why would you do that? Oh, okay. There's two exciting things here. The Golden Fleece people are back, and that right there is... Oh, that is really bad. Oh, no. There goes that. He killed it. Okay, that's really bad. That is actually a boss. That is actually a boss that was implemented for Christmas. Can we actually kill it? Let's try to bring it over here by these villagers. What is that? 
Ooh, that hurt, that hurt. Oh god, I'm stuck. Okay, kill it, kill it, come on. Woo! It's dead. Well, that was intense. Do we get like a prize for it at least? What is this? Frozen crystal core and some ice cubes. Seriously, is that it? Do we not get like a prize or anything? Is that... Oh wait, is it hiding under it? No, it... I guess it's just nothing then. That is kind of dumb. Okay, so apparently he's supposed to drop exclusive items, but um, this time he didn't, which kind of sucks. But for now, I guess we could just kill these things. It seems like they respawn, so I don't really feel bad for this. Oh, a rock elemental. But man, I swear, these... Like, these NPCs are too strong. They're just taking down things left and right. This is not even... Now, real quick, I'll show you guys kind of like the exploit that you could kind of use here. It's not like a huge exploit, but pretty much you could come in here. Man, these cows have a lot of health. You could pretty much kill the cows, grab their hide, and then uh, come back and they respawn. So it's pretty much like unlimited free hide. So let's see if we take our weapon out. Yeah, we can kind of just chill here and take their hide. But, I mean, hide isn't really a big issue for me. I don't really need it. I've kind of got hundreds already. But, just a little exp. Well, we're definitely not going any farther at this point. Because I don't even have a flying mount. So, I'm going to... Okay. I'm going to try to find some way back up this rock. And then we're going to head back. Is this griffin seriously going to try to attack me? Alright, I'm down, griffin. Let's get it, dude. Yeah, that's how you do it. Try to mess with Aqua. Yeah, that's a Wavern. Yeah, and I'll show you guys. If you attack this thing, it pretty much just runs away from you. It doesn't... Not, and that's partly why they're so hard to catch. Is because they don't stick around. You hit them and they just kind of peace out. So it's kind of hard to get them. I don't even know how I got mine in my other playthrough, honestly. I think I might have glitched it or something, but... Yeah, those things are pretty hard to get. Alright, guys. I might have just made it in time. It took forever to find this place. I'm just hoping my stuff is okay. And, of course, I couldn't have done it without my boy here. But, please... Oh, and the stupid griffin is still there. Well, let's try to grab my stuff. Oh, come on take all oh okay and we need to go oh that's such a long fall we need to get out of here that's for sure oh keep running this way and I'm pretty sure home is this way so Ooh, that was pretty lucky finding my stuff right there at the same time though now I gotta find home and I'm not 100% sure where that is. What is that? Is that an elephant? Master. Whoa, I've never seen one of those. Like, legitimately, I've never seen one of those. Oh, that's another bad thing. I don't know if that's rare or not, but that's kind of cool. Oh, there's two panthers over there. Got out 100%. There's another panther to our right. Stop for a little... Okay, get energy, energy. Woo, and we're off. Hoping nothing can't catch up. I don't think so. Alright, guys. And I think I'm going to leave off the episode right there. We didn't get too much done. But, um... I mean, we met the Krampus. We made a little sheep farm. And... Where, where is this thing? You. You have to die. Oh, okay. Come on. And I hate these fights, they're so like hard because they always like kind of like juke each other, it's so weird. But um, yeah, I'm going to end off today's episode next time. I don't know, I, I guess we'll just keep doing the doing, but one thing is for sure, I'm going to need to start breeding more stuff because we lost one Barunda. Uh, and oh my gosh, this thing has such a hard time getting up there. We have one more, and we got the saddle back, but we're definitely going to need another one in case we lose this one, if you know what I mean. So this one is stationary, right? Yeah. 
So then I guess what we'll do, we'll place the saddle on top of this bad boy. Let's increase its stamina and weight. But we're definitely gonna need, we're definitely gonna need to breed another one, and maybe we could snag snag up a high level one. That would be kind of cool. Let's make sure like there's nothing bad around here. And we did get some more ore, so we could go over here. And I can see a lot of our stuff's cooking. But we're gonna we're gonna need more wood in here. We have a lot of uh, this ash, which is really good actually. It's not a bad thing. This stuff is used in a lot of materials. Let's go ahead and take a stack of that out. Run over here. And then put this boy on fire. And then start cooking. There we go. Craft all of them. Alright guys. Can I turn this thing on? Because uh, I, I need some more light. There we go. Bam. Okay guys, thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to like and comment as it puts my channel. And I will see you guys later. I'm going to level up really, really quickly. Uh, what do we need? I guess stamina. And then health. God bless. And goodbye.